School Senior Class of 2023 enters Charlie Rawlings Memorial Gymnasium. You may be seated. Good morning, and welcome to the 123rd commencement exercise of Elizabethtown High School. I'm Thad Elmore, principal of Elizabethtown High School. Let me first state how honored I am to be here as an alumni of VHS who graduated in 1988. Students, you have survived COVID, a new principal, 
those job shadow days, tests, projects, and today you sit here to listen to Mr. Elmore and Mr. Goff say a couple words to you. But more importantly, we're going to take those final steps that you worked so hard for the past 12 years. I want to challenge you, whatever you do in your life, whether you decide to go to college, straight to the workforce, or into the military, effort and attitude are important. But above, above, but above all, remember to embrace yourself, embrace your unique talents, passions, and dreams. Trust in your abilities and never underestimate the impact you can have on the world. Now let's get moving. At this time, I'd like to recognize and thank several individuals who spent many hours ensuring that this graduation is memorable. When I call your name, if you're staying to be recognized, please, and hold your applause till the end. EHS senior class sponsor, Janae Bell, graduation organizer, Sammy Franklin and Kim Hartledge, the project graduation committee and their members, School counselors, Melissa Butler and Tanya Major. Assistant principals, Carl Olive and Jamie Reynolds. Athletic director, Alex Todd. The faculty and staff of Panther Academy, Helmwood Heights, Morningside, TK, Valley View, St. James, West Point. I thank you for your maintenance staff, Tommy Maggard, Donnie Walters, Terry Bowles, Tony Scott, for supporting us here for graduation and also project grad. Parents and family members who are here as well. Also, you may notice Miss Evans and Miss Goff around taking pictures. We do that so you don't have to get up from your seat and take pictures. It will be shared with you at the conclusion. At this time, I'd like to welcome and recognize our acting superintendent, Chase Goff, also our members of our Board of Education. Paul Godfrey, Kim Amon, Heather Sharpenstein, Guy Wallace, Wade Barnes. Graduation at Elizabethtown High School has traditionally been a dignified and special event for all graduates. It truly is a great graduation. We ask for all our graduates, family members, and guests to help us maintain this dignity and respect for all the graduates. We ask that you take pictures from your seat. Again, we have photographers on site for you. In case of an emergency, there's exits to the back and also to the sides, restrooms to the back and out this door as well. We also want each graduate to be recognized and their name heard. So we also ask any applauding, yelling, whistles and so forth to not occur. Each graduate has earned the right to hear their name and be recognized. We seek your cooperation with this. Now I'm pleased to present to you the Acting Superintendent of Elizabethtown Independent Schools, Chase Goff. Well, good morning. Welcome to the graduation ceremony for Elizabethtown High School class of 2023. Graduates for 13 years, you have had teachers stand before you to impart knowledge and wisdom. And I am definitely biased, but I believe in our school district, we have the best of the best. So there's nothing that I'm gonna be able to say or, or do that you haven't already, um, or, or not already prepared for. But I do have a couple of things about, uh, uh, that I'd like to share and I know a couple of things about graduation speeches. First, today is about you. It's not about me. I'm just lucky enough to be able to lead this district and stand before you. Second, simple is better. So with that, I have just two simple things that I'd like to share. Since you first entered our schools as E-Town Panthers, there's been four words in front of you. A, tradition of excellence. This morning, I'd like to spend just a second talking about that phrase. Now let me preface with an apology for any Auburn Tiger fans in the room, but I do believe Nick Saban is the greatest coach of this generation. And uh, that's okay, that's okay. Uh, but he had this quote, he said, in life you get five choices. You can decide to be bad, you can decide to be average, you can decide to be good, you can decide to be elite or excellent. And if you want to be excellent, you have to make the choice. You have to make that choice every day. See, excellence 
It's about doing the other things. It's about making the choice to go above and beyond. It's that extra rep in the weight room. It's that extra hour of studying for that big test. It's the time that you spend taking something that's good and making it great. See, I, I believe in my heart of hearts that excellence is always a choice. It's not something you're born into. You definitely have some, some opportunities with who your family is and where you were born. You definitely have an advantage because you got to be an E-Town Panther. But every single day, you have to make the choice to be excellent. And you all have demonstrated that. Last week, I got to sit where many of you all are sitting and see many of you recognized for incredible accomplishments and awards and scholarships. The class of 2023 made the choice day in and day out to be excellent. And my hope is that as you walk across this stage and you begin the next part of your life, that every day when you wake up, you make the choice to be excellent because that's what's been instilled in you as an E-Town Panther. Unlike excellence, tradition is not a choice. You can't create it, you can't fake it, you can't make it up, you can't wake up one day and decide that you're part of a tradition. Tradition is understanding that generations of people, many in this room and behind me on this stage, have come before you and they made the choice to be excellent. You're part of a district that's 217 years old. Year after year, generation after generation, person after person, Choices were made that created something that's far beyond what someone could do by themselves, what any of us could do by ourselves. Why are we everyone's rivals? Because of a tradition that's bigger than any single one of us. Today, you get to take another step into that tradition. You made the choices. You did the work. You achieved the mission. The class of 2023 is just another layer in that long tradition that we have that we get to celebrate today and that you get to be proud of. Life is not always easy. You'll have your fair share of challenges, and let me let you in on a little secret. It doesn't get any easier from here. But your educational career up to this point has shown you what excellence means. It's proven that person after person making the choice to do that builds a powerful tradition that's, any big, that's bigger than any one of us. And the world can take a lot of things from you, but one thing that it can never take away is that forever you are an E-Town Panther. You are part of that tradition of excellence. Congratulations, class of 2023, and as always, go Big E. In continuing with the longstanding tradition of Elizabethtown High School, we will have a member of the graduating class give the commencement address. The graduate that will be speaking today represents everything our school stands for and is built on, which is Panther pride and the tradition of excellence. This graduate is hardworking, respectful, and involved in several aspects of school life, as well as possessing a positive outlook on life. Graduates and guests, it is with great pleasure I present the 2023 commencement speaker, Lauren Godfrey. this class, I think of one thing, potential. As Ms. Lively would say, potential energy is energy that is stored, waiting to be used. This class has that. That potential has been evident since we stepped in these halls as broad-eyed freshmen in 2019, walking into Ms. Pullen's class and immediately being yelled at to spit out gum. While her rigidness was surprising in that moment, this set us up to be disciplined and do it was hard, even if we didn't want to. The discipline she instilled in us made us grow as students and also grew our potential that was just beginning to increase. This potential has been carried with us every day since that day, sunny day in August four years ago, steadily growing into what we see in this room today. That potential now, leaving the school that we spent the past four years in, is even greater. When I came to the school in 2019, I was terrified. I had all these questions running through my head of things that could go wrong stereotypical high school problems that weren't at all relevant to my high school experience. Freshman orientation was the first time we saw everyone in a room together. I remember seeing all these new faces and hearing the current sophomores and juniors talk about how fun high school is, hoping that my experience would be just as good. 
We were strangers then, but are now bonded by every experience we've had during our high school career. The potential of that room was tangible, and look how far we've come already. With 12 region championships, the most in any single year by any class in school history, a state proficiency ranking of 24, and a state champion for track, this potential has done wonders so far. Over the course of these four years, we've seen each other grow and persevere through extremely hard times. Going to state in 12 sports, ranking top in the state for academics, and many more accomplishments has made our class stand out. Going through COVID together gave us a new perspective on what matters. While my sophomore year was spent mostly in my bed during Google Meets, I can say I came out of that year a different person and can say the same for everyone here. That year tested us as a school and was rough because of the uncertainty that the future held, but that struggle made the ones following even better. Our junior year was filled with Hinkle lectures about war battles only he or Landon Casey could remember, and Sir ACT review sessions. It was also the last year our whole class was together in one building, which made it all the more special. It was our first full year since being shut down in 2020, and every Friday was basically a free day because of early release. That was the year we all learned covalent and ionic bonds in chemistry, even if I couldn't tell you the difference today. Junior year was really when we started working, when we got to show who we are as a class. It was when we started working towards our futures and figuring out what we wanted to do with our lives. We studied hard for goals far ahead of us, using the momentum of the previous two years to grow our potential even further. And senior year, starting off with senior sunrise in the luau, and just recently having prom and powder puff, going to as many games as possible because we knew they might be our last, growing closer to all of our classmates, especially in these last few weeks because of all the free time and ensuing card games that we jumped into, filling out applications in the fall for our futures and now knowing where those futures will be is surreal whether it be right here in E-Town or in California. We are sure to succeed as a class because of all we've gone through together and the potential that has been culminating since we arrived here. Looking out into this group of students, I see future lawyers, doctors, military members, and athletes. I see a class that has grown together these past four years and will use that growth to make a difference. A class that is just waiting to make their mark. A class that has been storing potential energy, just waiting for the right time to use it. High school has been the gaining of this potential energy. Let's see what we can do with it. Thank you, class of 2023, and as always, go Big E. Thank you. We'll be honoring several, several of our graduates uh, with some awards and honors. Uh, I'd first like to ask Athletic Director Alex Todd to come to the stage for our Andrew Clay Johnson Jr. Memorial Award. It is now my privilege to announce this year's winners of the Andrew Clay Johnson Jr. Memorial Award. This is a traditional award that has been given to a graduating senior since 1940. The award is given to a senior male and female who have participated in athletics and are outstanding in attitude, scholarship, and athletic ability. All senior athletes are voted on by the entire Elizabethtown High School faculty. Andrew Clay Johnson Jr. was the son of Dr. and Mrs. Andrew Clay Johnson. Dr. Johnson was the district superintendent of Memorial Methodist Church. They had moved to Elizabethtown when Andrew was a sophomore. He was a straight A student besides being active in athletics. In November of his senior year, Andrew became ill and died. Instead of erecting a costly gravestone, his parents established the Andrew Clay Johnson Junior Memorial Award. The recipients receive an individual plaque and their names are placed on a permanent plaque hanging in the commons area with all the winners since the 1939-1940 school year. It is my honor to announce this year's winners of the Andrew Clay Johnson Jr. Award. The female recipient is Ms. Sarah Clark. The male recipient is Mr. Landon Casey. The 
Thank you. To earn an associate's degree at ECTC, a student must earn at least 60 credit hours. We have two seniors this year who have earned this distinction. Both of these students participated in Panther College this year and also earned dual credit at EHS and also AP classes. In addition, both maintained a 4.0 GPA at ECTC. Would Chloe Hornback and Lainey Nally come forward at this time? Corey Hornback earned 36 credit hours at ECTC during the 22-23 school year and earned six credit hours in AP credit, earned 18 dual credit hours prior to the 22-23 school year. Lainey Nally earned 30 credit hours at ECTC during the 22-23 school year, earned 15 credit hours in AP credit, uh, earned 16 dual credit hours prior to the 22-23 school year. One more round of applause, congratulations. I would also like to take a moment and point out several of our graduates have honor cords or cords uh, that they have earned. As I call the color of the cord and description, the graduates please stand to be recognized. When the other group is called, you may be seated. Dark green cord is academic ready graduates. Orange Court is career ready graduates. Gold and White Court is work ethic gold graduate. Silver and White Court is work ethic silver graduate. White Court is Beta Club. Gray Court is Y Club member. Red, White, and Blue Court is for military graduates, which we have five. Please stand. We also had maroon and white, our cosmetology students, please stand. <laughs> At this time, I'd like now to recognize our honor graduates. To qualify as an honor graduate at Elizabethtown High School, it's a distinct accomplishment. It signifies a tireless devotion to academic excellence. In order to, main, uh, to be named an honor graduate, they must maintain a 95% or higher GPA their entire four years and must score a minimum of a 25 on an ACT. They must take at least seven AP honors or dual credit classes while they are enrolled at EHS. Each honor student will receive a golden honor cord and they have been awarded the privilege of signing the Book of Gold. Before we recognize our honor graduates, I want to present our salutatorian and valedictorian to be named salutatorian, a student must earn the second highest grade point average of all students in the graduating class. The 2023 salutatorian is Sarah Elizabeth Hansen. Please come forward.
To be named valedictorian, a student must earn the highest grade point average of all students in the graduating class. The 2023 valedictorian for Elizabethtown High School is Landon Walker Casey. The following students have qualified as honor graduates and will, will join the valedictorian and salutatorian on the risers. Graduates, as Ms. Butler calls your name, please come to the stage to receive your cord. We will call students forward in alphabetical order. Please hold your applause until the end. We have 37 graduates who will be honor graduates. Jackson Ballard. Bailey Bell, Nicholas Blair, Gavin Brunig, Lily Claggett, Caden Davis, Kaylee Davis, Nathan Demuth, Emma Fellows, Lauren Godfrey, Hannah Gray, Chloe Hornback, Caitlin Johnson, Ella Johnson, Gavin McGovern, Kylie McKinney, Chase Mormon, Zaina Mulvania, Emma Musgrave, Lainey Nally, Zachary Pretzis. Brennan Price, Brooklyn Reams, Brennan Ryan, Salok Samant, Jillian Sarver. Leah Schaefer, Thomas Shorey, Braden Shear, Alexander Spencer, Hendrix Thomas. Jason Tao, Andrew Varela, Madeline West, and Emma Zoller. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you our 2023 Honor Graduates of Elizabethtown High School. <laughs> Honor 
our graduates, you may be seated. Mr. Goff and members of the Board of Education, I now present to you the 2023 seniors who have completed the requirements for graduation as established by the State Board of Education and the Elizabethtown Board of Education. As a principal of Elizabethtown High School, I recommend that the board confer diplomas to these seniors on this 27th day of May, 2023. Mr. Olive will read each graduate's name and I ask you to please hold your applause until the end of the graduation ceremony so each student can hear his or her name. Our goal is to honor each and every graduate. First row, please stand. Timothy Kane Adams. Lupita Aguilar Fernandez. Dreema Nicole Aguirre. <laughs> Noah William Amatai, United <laughs> States Marine Corps. Adeline Ann Aldridge, University of Kentucky College Education Scholarship, and University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Zion Josiah Allen, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship. Janice Armstrong, Fisk University Academic Scholarship, Fisk University Athletic Scholarship. Andrew James Ashley. Jackson Neil Ballard, Honor Graduate, University of Tampa Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Landon Banks. Bailey Bell, Honor Graduate, Ohio University Academic Scholarship. Zachary Douglas Berger. Raya Jashelle Bester. <laughs> Mariana Betancourt. <laughs> Andrea Marie Biggs. Scholarship recipient. Nicholas Matthew Blair, honor graduate, Center College Academic Scholarship, local scholarship recipient. Carter John Blankenship. <laughs> Levi Franklin Blevins. Reagan Elaine Braden, University of Louisville. <laughs> Gavin Robert Bruning, undergraduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, local scholarship recipient. Jaden Dean Brown. <laughs> Noah Carter Jason Brown. Trenton Burgess. Elizabeth Danielle Burkhart. Ashlyn Lee Can, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, local scholarship recipient. Brooklyn Dale. 
Can, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Austin Brian Cargill. Andrew Kane Carmen, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. <laughs> Landon Walker Casey, Valedictorian, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, National Scholarship Recipient, Local Scholarship Recipient. Brock Wayne Cabot, Campbellville Academic Scholarship. Michael Thaddeus Ennis Cecil, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship, Western Kentucky University Music Scholarship. <laughs> Lily Arnett Leggett, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship. Sarah Elizabeth Clark, Elizabethtown Community and Technical College Academic Scholarship. Devonte Lawan Clay. Yeah. Jansen Cockerham, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, Army ROTC Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Caleb Kreider, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Jacob Dylan Cundiff. Caden McGuire Davis, Honor Graduate, Lindsey Wilson Academic Scholarship, Lindsey Wilson Athletic Scholarship. Kaylee Ray Davis, Honor Graduate, Center College Academic Scholarship. Jonathan Austin De La Fuente. Nathan Reyes DeMuyo, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Demaya Danielle Doctor, in Wales University Academic Scholarship. Dante D'Angelo Doctor. Brandon Alexander Duffy. Madeline Bo Elin. Train Edmonds, Campbellville University Academic Scholarship, Campbellville University Athletic Scholarship. Bryce Douglas Estes, Kentucky Wesleyan Co College Academic Scholarship, Kentucky Wesleyan College Athletic Scholarship. Emma Catherine Fellows, Honor Graduate, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Gavin Reese Ferguson. Jace Fields Wright. David Bradley Florence. Jackson Randall Ford, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Jaylen McKenzie Ayana Franklin. Yeah! Zachary Lee Gadlich. Yeah! Isabella Garcia. Ash Gardner. Aliana Jai Garris, Bellarmine University Academic Scholarship. Madison Danielle Dutrost. <laughs> Bethany Lane Gawking, Campbellsville University Academic Scholarship, Campbellsville University Performance Scholarship. 
Lauren Teresa Godfrey, Honor Graduate, Bucknell University Academic Scholarship. Brittany Jean Goins, Robert Morris University Academic Scholarship, Robert Morris University Athletic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Paola Gomez, Local Scholarship Recipient. Andrew Ryan Grant, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Darius Stephen Grant, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Darius! Hannah Nicola Gray, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Kate Ann Gray Sarek, University of Indianapolis Academic Scholarship, University of Indianapolis Art and Design Scholarship. Micaiah Song Green, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. William Ryder Gregory. Sarah Elizabeth Hansen, Salutatorian, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky College of Engineering Scholarship, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, National Scholarship Recipient, Local Scholarship Recipient. Jacob Labori Hare, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. <laughs> Tylea Amaya Victoria Harris, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Ahmed Ray Hasuane. Hawkins. Chase Wesley Hawkins, local scholarship recipient. LaRon Ivan Hay. Yeah! Lachey Marie Hay. Dylan Joseph Henry. Maya Analethia Hernandez Darty Page. Julian Sebastian Hicks. Chloe Brianne Hornback, Honor Graduate, Elizabeth Town Community and Technical College Associate Degree, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, National Scholarship Recipient, Local Scholarship Recipient. Avery J. Housh, Georgetown College Academic Scholarship, Georgetown College Athletic Scholarship. O'Brien T. Howard, Union College Athletic Scholarship. Grant Alexander Humble. Tsunami Juline Jenkins Freeman. Austin Clayton Jennings, Southeastern Illinois College Athletic Scholarship. Angel Johnson. Elizabeth Johnson, West Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Rafaela Claire Kerba Johnson, Honor Graduate, University of Tennessee Academic Scholarship, University of Tennessee Athletic Scholarship. Lily Boo Jones. Dylan Cecil Kerr. Samuel John Kessinger, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship, Army ROTC Scholarship. Kaylee Knight. Woo! 
Jacob F. Craigbaum, United States Army. Donovan Luke Lapora. Caleb Austin Lingerfeld. Adeline Loeffler. Jacob Tyler Mayo. Aaron Quinn McBride. Gavin Sean McGovern, Honor Graduate, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship, National Scholarship Recipient. I know him. <laughs> Kylie Ann McKinney, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Dallas Lloyd McVeigh, United States Navy. Go Navy! Woo! Owen Blaine McCray, Eastern Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Henry Jared Montero Sanchez. <laughs> Seth Tao. Chase Richard Mormon, Honor Graduate, Transylvania University Academic Scholarship. Molly Elizabeth Morton, Eastern Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Yeah, Molly! Zainab Naor Mavania, Honor Graduate, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship, National Scholarship recipient. Renaya Izalik. <laughs> Alize Murphy. Emma Alejandra Musgrave, Honor Graduate, Center College Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Briar Lee Joy Nall. Laney, Fran uh, Laney Francis Nolly. Honor graduate, Elizabethtown Community and Technical College Associate Degree, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. <laughs> Philip Diego Navarrete. Nathan Chase Nett, Western Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Ezekiel Jarrell Nixon. Samuel Douglas Northen, Eastern Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Kaylee Elizabeth Norton. Austin Lewis Parker. Matthew Aiden Parsons, Brescia University Academic Scholarship, Brescia, Brescia University Athletic Scholarship. R.J. Pence. Marcus Lloyd Phelps. Charlotte Naomi Kayembe Pewitz. Mount St. Joseph University Academic Scholarship. Zachary Edward Prestis, Honor Graduate, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship. Brennan Michael Price, Honor Graduate, University of Rochester Academic Scholarship. Jordan Michael Price, Lindsey Wilson College Academic Scholarship, Lindsey Wilson College Athletic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Jude Casey, Early Graduate, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship. Liberty, Danielle Ratcliffe. Brooklyn.
and Daphne Marie Ann Reams, Honor Graduate, Eastern Kentucky University Academic Scholarship, National Scholarship recipient. Camden, Rich B Bennett Rich, Georgetown College Academic Scholarship. Logan, Dustin Rockwell. Brennan, Eric Ryan, Honor Graduate, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Salok Zamont, Honor Graduate, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship. Justin Anthony Sanders, United States Army. Zakari Sanders. Jillian Page Sarver, Honor Graduate, University of Louisville McConnell Scholar, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship, Army ROTC Scholarship. Evan Matthew Schaefer, Murray State University Academic Scholarship. Leah Marie Schaefer, Honor Graduate, Holy Cross College, Notre Dame Academic Scholarship. Seth Andrew Schaefer, Murray State University Academic Scholarship. Thomas James Shorey Jr., Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Ash Marie Scobie. <laughs> Talia Therese Scott. Ethan Michael Siegel. Nathaniel Scott Self. Braden Alexander Shearer, Honor Graduate, Transylvania University Academic Scholarship, National Scholarship Recipient, Local Scholarship Recipient. Evan Matthew Shelton, Moorhead State University Academic Scholarship. Aaron Enrique Silva. Asharia Alicia Skillman, Local Scholarship Recipient. Destiny Rose Smallwood, Elizabethtown Community and Technical College Academic Scholarship. <coughs> Aiden Christopher Smith, Chapman University Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Delaney Claire Sondergaard. Alexander Pike Spencer, honor graduate. William Ray Spicer. Haley Lynn St. Pierre. Lacey Ann Daphne Marie Streeter. Nicholas Lee Taylor. Maria Isabella Tenorio Avellino. Chase Xavier Thomas. Hendricks Lee Thomas, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Sydney May Thomas, Elizabeth Town Community and Technical College Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Ethan Allen Thurman.
Tyler, Aspen, Todd. Charles Christopher Tompkins. Jason Thomas Tao, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Lashari Sharice Troutman. Ramaya Inez Marie Trow. Andrew Coleman Varela, Honor Graduate, Transylvania University Academic Scholarship. Bria Pauline Walker Bird, West Kentucky University Academic Scholarship, State Scholarship Recipient, Local Scholarship Recipient. Aiden Drake Walls, West Kentucky University Academic Scholarship, Army ROTC Scholarship. Marquette Watts. Thomas Alexander Wells. Madeline Grace West, Honor Graduate, Eastern Kentucky University Academic Scholarship. Lucas Adam Wheatley. Cena Claire Whalen, Loyola University, New Orleans Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Hope Sousa Williams, University of Louisville Academic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Juju Williams. Kendall Marlise Williams. Ellie Twin Willoughby, Elizabethtown Community and Technical College Academic Scholarship. Andrew Paul Wilson, University of Cumberland's Athletic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Caleb Michael Wood, Local Scholarship Recipient. Madison Amanda Wartman, Holy Cross College, Notre Dame, Academic Scholarship, Army ROTC Scholarship. Gavin Lee Young, Campbellsville University Academic Scholarship, Campbellsville University Athletic Scholarship, Local Scholarship Recipient. Mackenzie May Young. Emma Catherine Zoller, Honor Graduate, University of Kentucky College of Engineering Scholarship, University of Kentucky Academic Scholarship. Anna Julia Perego. Carl Laron Hobson. officers come forward to lead us in our tassel ceremony. Senior class officers. Okay. 
Okay, hi everyone, my name is Gavin Brunig and I'm the senior class president. Chloe Hornback, the senior class vice president. Landon Casey, the class secretary. Adeline Aldridge, class treasurer. And before we get on with the tassel training ceremony, I just want to say one thing, and it's that I'm very proud of all that our class has done in the past four years, especially given what we've gone through. I feel like Lauren captured it very well in her speech, especially when she talked about the potential that our class has, because that's all I see when I look out here today. And I will say that, and I believe I speak for the rest of my class officers, when I say that there's no better class that we could have served, and I thank you all for that. So anyway, moving on uh, with the tassel training ceremony. Uh, graduates, please stand. So it, it, it is our honor to lead the seniors in the tassel turning ceremony. The tassel will be turned from your right to your left. This is the last collected act of the Elizabethtown High School class of 2023. Seniors, turn your tassels. The class of 2023 has left a, le a lasting legacy of excellence, honor, and success at Elizabethtown High School. And our tradition of excellence at EHS was made stronger because of you all. At this time, it is with Panther pride that I now pronounce you graduates of Elizabethtown High School. Congratulations. Yeah. 